a times where we fall, make mistakes, and blow it. Hello guys, this is Shundal. And today's show is just about a failure is an event. In life, we all going to have times where we fall, make mistakes, and blow it. But too often, we get our performance mixed up with our identity. We may have failed, but you are not a failure. That's what you did. Failure is an event. That's not who you are. You are a child of the Most High God. You've been humped by the Creator of the universe. God is not judging you by your setbacks. Maybe you you blown out a relationship, had an addiction, or done something you're not proud of. Don't let that become your identity. God's mercy is bigger than any mistakes that you've made. Guys, I want to share with you what is written in 1 Corinthians 6:11, as it says, "But you were washed, you were sanctified, you were justified in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ and by the Spirit of our God." Remember, guys, the scriptures. Your sins have been already forgiven, as it says. You were washed, you were sanctified, you were justified in the name of the Lord Jesus. Yes, we have to believe that we are forgiven. Every mistake we've made and ever will make has already been paid in full. The real question here is, will you receive God's mercy? You don't have to go around feeling guilty, not excited about your future. You are free. You are clean. You are restored. Guys, we have to acknowledge that the love of God and forgiveness to us is not based on our performance, but upon the fact that He is our Creator. We must understand that every mistakes we made and ever will make has already been paid in full by jesus christ in the cross we must believe that we are clean we must believe that we are free we must believe that we are restored just think that failure is just an event it did not pronounce you who you are the failure is just happening there it's just an event and it will pass by it will not last forever as it says in the scripture that we were washed we were sanctified we were justified in the name of jesus and by the spirit of God. We have to acknowledge that. We have to understand that. As a child of God, guys, we must understand that when we ask forgiveness, God have forgive us. When we ask something, He will give it to us. Every day, guys, I am asking forgiveness to God. I am asking him to guide me because many times we are not aware about it. We are committing mistakes even we don't mean it. It just happens suddenly and it's very difficult to work with it right away, especially when our life is in chaos, especially when we face different kinds of problems, especially when struggles in life is too hard so therefore guys it is very important that you feel good with yourself you are confident enough to say to yourself i am free i am clean i am restored i am forgiven the moment you ask 
God is already working towards your behalf. Yes, He is working behind the scenes for our behalf. It is like that. Believing to the unseen, guys, it's really takes a lot of courage. Therefore, faith must be developed in it. Many people believe in God, but they are not really practicing it. But guys, I don't have a choice. I live here in a foreign country struggling into something of different kinds of challenges in life. But how can I really make it if I don't have that holding point? So I believe in the scripture. I believe in God. I don't have a choice. When I am in struggle, I have to dwell onto Him. I have to invite Him into my life every day. Of course, I commit failures. Of course, I commit mistakes. But I've learned that failure is just an event. It will come and goes into our life. The important here, guys, that we know how to acknowledge it and ask forgiveness we are all human we all have weaknesses so therefore it is very important that we can acknowledge it right away oh, oh this is a mistake this is not good i have to ask forgiveness this is just my share guys i am not perfect i am just working with myself and through this life journey i survive life because I am using the scripture as my tool in my daily life to live day by day. This is Yundel. Thank you for listening. Thank you for dropping here in my channel. I am very grateful to each and every one of you. I love you all and bye-bye.